I love the thought of being out there again. I mean, because I, I forgot how much I miss being a face of deception. Well, I'm sure you give as much pleasure as you get. Thank you. And thank you for upping my stock with Lucy. You know, I truly believe that she had no intention of coming up with a new campaign for me until you and I walked in there together. Just think, I could become the face of Jack's deception. Well, you never know. Doesn't matter. Either way, it's the perfect time for my face to be plastered all over billboards and buses and newsstands so, so that people can't go anywhere without being confronted by my face. idiotic <laughs> yeah Lois is into public displays of affection so so it's obvious I'm wasting my time here what are you saying that you're giving up on her no I'm just starting to give Ashton a break I haven't a doubt that if I continued my campaign I'd win Lois for myself there they are <laughs> the epitome of wedded bliss why should I ruin it? Well, because you want her and you always get what you want, remember? Oh, believe it or not, I want Lois to be happy. True, I believe ultimately she'd be happier with me, but not before going through the misery of divorce court. Plus, having to put up with the lousy loser Ashton would surely be. No, I might as well call the airport and get them to fire up my jet take myself out of their lives. <laughs> you can't do that. Jack, you can't leave. I mean, how could you even think about that? Why not? <laughs> I mean, look at her. You can see the sparkle in her eyes all the way across the room. Yeah, see, that's that same sparkle you want looking at you. Let me put it to you this way. If Lois were a company I wanted to acquire, I'd first look into how much it would cost me. Yeah, and you would measure it against what you would expect to gain. Right. I'd look at the balance sheet. I'd weigh it against other investments I might be considering. But there are no others for you, right? True. I'd also look at... Uh, the effect my acquiring would have on prospective returns. What, I lost you? No, you didn't lose me. Um, I hope you realize that I see through all your pseudo-business cover-up. You're scared. What? <laughs> you are. I mean, you must be. Otherwise, why would you go on and on about how crazy you are about Lois? Just to turn around and let her go because you happen to see her kiss her husband in public again? Because I've learned when to move on. When an investment isn't worth the hassle. Uh, but you've already started investing. Jack, Lois isn't a business. She's flesh and blood. And you still want her. Well, never claimed otherwise. Oh, well, see, so there you go. So you can't give up. I mean, what are you thinking? Listen, I will not let you give up. Hey, I'm your friend. Okay, Jack. I really want you to stay here. In fact, I will personally deliver Lois into your hands. 